do it yesterday. So you are live, do not say fuck or bugger. Okay. First thing we're gonna do is get warm. Okay, so today we are gonna be working on an upper body um, strength related stuff. So the tempo, all the stuff we're gonna be working on is focused on the upper body. And then as yesterday, we're gonna go into an EMOM. So uh, as I spoke about yesterday, a lot of it's gonna be time under tension, a lot of isometric holds, a lot of staying still in positions. Um, and the reason we're gonna do that is so that we can still get a good workout of your muscle without having to use any kits. But before we do any of that, we need to get the heart rate going and we need to get uh, you nice and mobile. So, first thing we do, find yourself a space. Health and safety checks, arms up, spin around, make sure we're not gonna hit anything, okay? Arms up above your head, you've not got like a light shade above there, you're not gonna crack your head on anything. Yeah, so we're all good, spatial awareness is fine. I'm just gonna start a timer, we're going to do 20 seconds of each exercise. Bear with me two seconds. First exercise we're going to do, guys, is heel flicks. So we're just standing on the feet, flicking the heels up to the bar. Off we go, heel flicks. In fact, I'm going to stand my timer right here. So heels right up to the bum, just staying nice and light on the toes. Good, back to the music on, let's go. And then we're going to go to high knees to the front. If we can bounce from foot to foot, great. If we can't, just stand and swap the feet over, drive the knees. If we can bounce, try and get your knees up to hip height if we can, yeah? Really driving them knees up. Good, five more seconds, keep them going. Keep them going. Tan, you can bounce, you're just being lazy. Okay, now we're gonna try on a little bit more complicated. It's called a cross jack. We're gonna cross this way. It's like an Irish jig. The hand follows the foot, okay? So as the right foot goes in front, the right hand goes up. Left, hand, left foot in front, left hand goes up, okay? Irish jig, off we go. Good, keep it going. Keep it going, keep it going. 10 more seconds. Stay nice and light on your feet, guys, nice and light on your feet. If you've got any Irish music, feel free to put it on. And the last one, we're gonna do walkout. So, hands to the floor, walk right the way up. Nice long position, keep your bum solid, don't drop it down. Walk right the way back in. Stand up one vertebrae at a time, off we go. For these, we're gonna do five reps. We're not doing these for count, we're doing these for five reps. Tan, do what on any lunges for me. Because it's a hip opening drill. Good stuff. As you're walking out, guys, make sure we keep the hips nice and strong. Don't drop them to the floor. We're just doing five repetitions. So walk out, stand up five times. When you've done your five reps, I just want you jogging on the spot with two thumbs up. Jogging on the spot with two thumbs up. When I see that all over the screen, we're going to go into the next round. Good, 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 good. Yeah, we're all in. Okay, back to heel flips. Off we go. We're going through round two. We can go a little bit quicker this time, okay? We're gonna to start to get that heart rate up a little bit, break a little bit of the sweat. Try and get your heels all the way to the bum if you can. You're literally kicking yourself up the ass. Good, big kicks, big kicks, big kicks. Five more seconds. And bring it to the front on the higher knees. Driving their knees up, try and get to hip height if we can, so from the side, driving that knee up, driving that knee up, driving that knee up, okay? Go as fast as you can, form over everything though, make sure you land them gently. Bet you can get their knees up higher than that, are you trying to kid? Keep it going, keep it going, five more seconds, keep these knees high guys. Good stuff, good stuff. Tang, get your top off, get back in, come on. And cross jacks, off we go. Remember, hand follows the foot that goes to the front. Good, keep it going. Looking good. Do you know what, if this all does go Pete Tom, we'll start an Irish dance team. I reckon we'll be all over it. Keep it coming, guys, keep it going. 
Oh, Rachel's got a wardrobe malfunction. Get the hair up. We're good to gas it. You can jig while you're doing it. Keep going. Five more seconds, guys. Keep going. Stay on your toes. Stay on your toes. And walk outs. Five repetitions. Walk it right the way out, right back in. Remember, we're not going to drop the hips. Hips stay nice and strong. Walk it back in. One work rep time. Five repetitions. When you've done your five, we're jogging on the spot with the thumbs up again. I did remind you guys at the beginning, if you've got a my zone belt, make sure you're wearing it. Good, keep it going, keep it going. Yeah, thumbs up, looking all snazzy, jogging on the spot, thumbs up when you've done your five reps. <laughs> looking good. Love the enthusiasm, Beck. Nice guys, nice guys, nice guys. Yeah, okay, we're all jogging. We're gonna go last round, this round. Every single time, we want to get as many reps in as you can. So we're really gonna get that heart rate up so that we're primed and good to go. So straight into heel flicks. Go, as many as you can. As many as you can. Really drive them heels up to the bottom. Let's get them heart rates up. Nice and quick on your feet. Nice and quick on your feet. Laura, please do not tread on your dog. <laughs> I see it running around under your feet. Do not tread on the dog. Good, keep going guys, keep going. A few more seconds, and straight into high knees, let's go, as many as you can. High knees to the front, driving them up, driving them up, driving them up, driving them up. Good stuff. Good stuff, come on Claire, get in. Yeah, love it, love it, let's go. Let's go, stay on them feet. Nice and light. Carl Louise, get them knees up, I know your legs are tired. Keep going, a few seconds. And cross jacks, off we go. Nice and quick, nice and quick, nice and quick. Nice and quick. Good, stay right up on your toes, guys. This is good. Keep it going. Remember, we're just warming up still. Many reps as we can. Three. Two, one, and into the walkouts, five reps. Walk it all the way up, keep the hips strong, do not let your hips drop. Five repetitions, let's go. Looking good guys, looking good. Time already. Okay, when you're done, just stay still, give me a thumbs up, thumbs up everywhere. We don't need to jog on the spot anymore. We're just gonna do some quick mobility drills for the shoulders and then we're gonna crack on. When I see thumbs up on every screen, we're good to go. Grab a quick mouthful of water, guys. 20 seconds, mouthful of water, we'll do some mobility. Just get the shoulders going. Real simple. This is all body weight, so we don't need to worry too much about um, massive amounts of mobility drills. We're just gonna start to loosen up the shoulders a little bit and your hip flexors. Because anyone who did yesterday's workout, the legs are probably feeling a little bit sore. Okay, first things first, we're just gonna do shoulder rotations. So uh, I'll stand to the side, so I'm gonna pull my shoulders back, pull them up nice and high, and do big circles, okay? Now really exaggerate how big you're making that circle. So from the front, I'm pulling my shoulders back, up, and then all the way around, okay? Really, really big circles. Keep going, keep going. Okay, now we're gonna do it with the arms. So we're gonna go backwards first, right the way back. Try and touch your hands together behind your back, as you can see here. Come right the way around, touch the ceiling. At the top, touch the ceiling, and then touch the wall in front of you. So really big circles. Don't just do them like this, like you used to do in PE. Real big circles, so push them back as far as you can right up to the ceiling. You're gonna go around six times, nice and slowly. Just loosening them shoulders off. And then we do exactly the same, but this time going backwards. So we go up to the front, first of all, up to the ceiling, right the way around the back. Try and touch your hands behind you, and then bring them around to your hips. Five circles backwards. Nice and slow, guys. Keep it nice and slow. Stay to the tempo. Oh, 
Okay. We've all done five reps, gonna be two thumbs up, so we're good to go. We're gonna start working on the upper body strength. So what's gonna happen, guys? Like yesterday, I'm gonna give you a quick demo of the repetitions um, and the tempo, and then my main focus is gonna be on counting them out and watching you. So we're going to do good old-fashioned push-ups, first of all, but we're gonna do them with a three-second lower, a two-second hold at the bottom, and then a three-second upper. We're gonna aim for 10 reps. Now you can do these either um, with your feet on the floor or on your knees, which I'm gonna show you now. So this is the sort of tempo we're looking for. If we're gonna do conventional, we're gonna go one, two, three, hold, one, two, up, one, two, three, straight back down, two, three, hold for two, up, two, three, okay? If we're gonna do them on the knees, however, we're going to do the same rules, but I want you to make sure that the hips are going to go down with the body as well. So what we don't want to do is push-ups like this. What we want to do is get the chest between your hands, and we're going to go down here. So the whole body goes towards the floor, and then we come back up. Okay? So if you've got your cameras, get it down into a floor position. If you can get it side on, even better. We're going to start in 10 seconds. So we're going to go on my account. Push up position. Okay, we're gonna start lowering in five, four, three, two, one, and lower. Three, two, one, hold, four, two, then up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, one, two, three, down, one, two, Three, hold, one, two, up, one, two, three, good, down, one, two, three, hold, one, two, up, one, two, three, down, one, two, three, hold that pause, one, two, up, one, two, three, down, one, two, three, stay with it, hold, one, two, up, one, Two, three, couple more down. One, two, three, hold. One, two, up. One, two, three, one more down. One, two, three, hold. One, two, up. One, two, three, shake out there. Good stuff. Shake out, grab a quick drink of water, guys. Quick drink, we're gonna take about 25 seconds and we're gonna do the next set. If anyone ever told you you can't train strength with body weight, they lied. You absolutely can, as we're learning today. Okay, we've got about five seconds, quick mouthful of water. Really important, as we're going down on the push-ups, I want you guys to uh, try and envision is put your chest between your hands, okay? So we don't want the arms up here in this flared position. So my hands, uh, my wrist is stacked under my shoulders in the push-up, and as I come down, my, my head is above my hands and my hands are either side of my chest. Okay, elbows tucked in nice and tight. Better for your shoulders. We don't want shoulder niggles. Okay, let's get in position. We're going to start in five, four, three, two, one. Descend. Three, two, one. Hold. One, two, up. Three, two, one. Down. Three, two, one. Hold. One, Two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, keep it going, up, three, two, one down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, keep it going down, three, two, one, concentrate, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, 
two, up, three, two, one, two more, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, last one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, rest there. Good stuff. Okay, we're gonna take a 30 second up, then we're gonna go again, we've got one more round of that. One more round, good stuff. When you're coming down, guys, when you're doing the hold at the bottom, make sure your chest isn't completely on the floor, okay? So you wanna be holding ourselves just off the floor, getting that real isometric contraction. I can see a lot of people are getting foul reps on that second set, which is good. It shows that we're working the muscles to where we want them. We don't wanna be doing an easy set of 10. We want it nice and challenging. And if you're failing reps, we're working the muscles that we're targeting, so that's good stuff. Okay, we've got five seconds. Back in position, mouthful of water done. Let's keep cracking on. Starting in five, four, three, two, one. Down, three, two, one. Hold, one, two, up, three, two, one. Down, three, two, one. Hold, one, two, up, three, two, one. Down, three, two, one. Hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, keep it going, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, keep pushing Lindsay, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, come on down and hold it, two, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, get back in Becky, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, one more rep, down, three, two, one, hold, one, two, up, three, two, one, 20 push-ups, off you go, 20 push-ups, bang them out, nice and quick, Louise, don't look at me like that, I can see you through the camera, <laughs> let's go, let's go. If Cass is there, tell her to join in. Let's go, 20 reps. When you've done 20 full reps, if you need to shake out halfway through, that's fine, but you don't stop till you've done 20. You get back in, 20 reps. Laura, let's see if we can get that chest closer to the floor, yeah? Get that chest down to the floor, come on. Nose on the floor, Laura, I wanna see it. I know the arms are tired, Laura, stay with me, come on. Come on, get that nose on the floor. Keep going. Don't headbutt the floor, but make sure you do get, get all the way down there, guys. When you're done, I want to see everyone sit and give me two thumbs up. I'm waiting for still movements. Come on, guys, keep pushing. 20 reps. When we're done, thumbs up. Go on to the next bit. Good stuff. Your arms are probably really feeling this already. So the next bit, we've actually got two options. We've got two options. We can either do, uh, I'll, I'll leave it up to you which one you want to do. I'm going to show you a pike version of a push-up, or I'm going to show you a close grip push-up, okay? So what we're doing on a close grip, we're really working um, the triceps, okay? So you're going to make a diamond when you're doing your push-ups. I'll show you in a moment. Pike push-up, we're going to put the bum up in the air, and we're going to come down forehead towards the floor. That's going to work the triceps, but you're also going to get, going to get a lot of your shoulders, your lats, your rhomboids, and all the surrounding muscles around the shoulders. Um, the pike push-up is definitely more difficult, so uh, have a look at them. By all means, we'll, we'll have 30 seconds to try them out, decide what one we're going to do, and then we're going to crack, what, uh, crack on what we're doing. It's going to be under a 3 one three, um, tempo, so three seconds down, hold for one, three seconds up. I'll show you the two movements real quick. Pike push-up first. Here we go. Down into position. You're going to turn your hands, fingers towards each other. Okay, so I'm going to put my fingers towards each other. I'm going to put my thumb up in the air. I'm going to straighten my legs as much as I can. My elbows are going to go out to the side. And I'm going to move my head down to the floor for three. Three, two, one. Hold for one. Three, two, 
one. Straight back in, three, two, one. Hold for one, three, two, one, okay? That's a particularly tricky exercise, okay? So by all means, we'll give it a try before we do it. If not, we're gonna do conventional push-ups, but instead of having our hands here, we're gonna make a diamond shape. Now, for some people, you'll be able to put your hands together. Some people may get wrist pain when you're doing that, so we can take it out slightly, but we want a nice close grip push-up. Everything else with a close grip push-up is the same. So the hips are still down, and we're gonna do the same sort of tempo where we go here, three, two, one, hold for one, three, two, one. Same with a conventional push-up. You can either do that on your knees or you can do it on your feet. Okay, so what I wanna do, guys, before we dive in, 30 seconds from now, try them out, decide which one you're gonna do. Let's do that now, please, 30 seconds. When you're doing the pike push-ups, think about getting your forehead towards the floor. So look at your feet and think forehead towards the floor if you're doing the pike push-ups, okay? So it's really on your shoulders. If not, we can do close grips. So don't do too many reps. Don't want you to tie yourself out. Just kind of get a feel for them. A couple of reps is fine. If you're happy, you know what you're doing. Good. Elena, really push them elbows out so we can get that head down, yeah? Get them shoulders working. <laughs> Good stuff. You want to get your forehead just off the floor. If you can, if you can hold it. If not, I'd recommend doing the close grips. When we're all happy with what we're doing, give me some thumbs up. I want to see thumbs up on the screen so that we've tested it and we're good to go. The tempo is going to be the same for either exercise. And do close grips, mate. Close grips. You can do close grips with that. I know you can because you've done it before. <laughs> okay. Let's get into position then. You ready? We're going to start in five, four, three, two, one. And down for three, two, one. Hold for one. Up. Three, two, one. Down. Three. Two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, nice and slow, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, two more, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, slow on that way up, let's go one more, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, eight normal reps, off you go, eight reps. Less tempo, eight more repetitions. Just do normal eight repetitions. And then I get that chest to the floor for me, yeah? Get right the way down there. Hey, go on, get down there, get that chest on the floor. Yes, Hayley, good girl, love that. Becky, chest to the floor, yeah? Come on, get down there, get that chin on the floor. I know we're getting tired, guys. Laura, same as, get that chest to the floor, all the way down. Remember, chest between your thumbs. Get down there, get that body working. We're gonna struggle, guys, it's never gonna be easy. Okay, when we're done, thumbs up, we're all done with the reps. Yep, 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 good to go. Okay, 10 seconds, we'll start the next set. Upper body should be feeling it. I mean, I have only, I've only demoed a couple of reps and my upper body's shaking already. Okay, we're good. Back in next set then, we're gonna start in five, four, three, two, one, down for three, two, one hold for one up three two one down three two one hold for one up three two one down three two one hold for one up three two one down three two one hold for one up three two one down three two one hold for one up three two one get back in back down three two one hold for one up three two 
One, come on Melissa, let's go. Down, three, two, one. Hold for one, up, three, two, one. One more, down, three, two, one. Hold for one, up, three, two, one. 10 normal reps, off you go. Whatever you're doing, close grip or plaque, do 10 more reps. Repetitions, repetitions, chest to floor, chest to floor. Come on, I wanna see that movement. I wanna see that movement. Elena, chest to floor, good, good. Yes, Cam, chest to floor, love it. Laura, chest to floor, good, get down there. Come on, Becky, you can get lower than that. You can get lower than that. Yeah, there it is, get down there. Come on, I know the arms are tight, get down there. Come on, get it, oh, we it, Becky, what happened? Come on, get the last few reps in. Get them last few reps in, guys. When we're done, give me a thumbs up. <laughs> I, I don't know if anyone can see Becky's screen, but she really fought to get one more rep and just completely flopped on the floor. It was great. 10 seconds. 10 seconds, we're going again. We've got one more round. One more round. See, the arms are feeling it, guys. The arms are feeling it. We can still strength train. We've just got to learn to use our body. Okay, we're going to go in five. Let's get in. Let's get in. Last one. Keep pushing. Five, four, three, two, one. Lowering then. Three, two, one. Hold for one. Up. Three, two, one. Down. Three, two, one. Hold for one. Up. Three, two, one. Down. Three, two, one. Hold for one. Up, three, two, one. Good control, Cam. Down, three, two, one. Hold for one. Up, three, two, one. Down, three, two, one. Hold for one. Up, three, two, one. Down, three, two, one. Hold for one. Up, three, two, one, two more reps, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one, last one, down, three, two, one, hold for one, up, three, two, one. Let's go 15 reps, go, 15 repetitions. Whatever you're doing, close grips or plaque push-ups, 15 reps, let's get it done. Let's get it done, I know we saw guys, 15 reps, go. Come on, Beck, shake them off, let's go. I know the upper body's filled with blood. The triceps are definitely going to be burning. The shoulders are going to be sore. Get them done. Come on, Haley, get down lower than that. Let's go, come on. I know we're struggling, guys. If you do five and then you fail, you can give it a quick shake out and go again, but keep going until you get to 15. When you've got to 15, I want to see thumbs up on the screen so I know we're done and we're not just taking a rest to finish them. Good, 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 good. Got you, Louise. Diana's, Diana's dying there. Die, you look sore. Okay, we're going to do the heart rate stuff now. Okay, we all done, we all done, we all done. Okay, we're going into the EMOM. Now, the EMOM, we have got four different exercises. So the way it's going to work, minute one, we're going to do 15 Indian squats. Minute two, we're going to do straight leg Romanian, uh, sorry, single leg Romanian deadlifts, as many as we can in a minute. I'm going to show you these exercises, so don't panic about them now. Third minute, we're going to do 15 toe touch sit ups. And then for the fourth minute, we're going to do bicycle crunches, as many as we can in a minute. Stand by for your abs to feel really, really sore. Um, actually, before we go into the EMOM, we're going to do some extended planks. I just remembered we've got to do some 30 second holds before we go into the EMOM. We'll come back to that. Um, Extended plank, for anyone that doesn't know, is basically when you do a plank position, but your hands are going to be over your head instead of under your shoulders. If you can do that, great. If not, you're going to do conventional planks. And we're going to hold it for 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off, three rounds. So just a quick demo. Conventional plank. We're going to have hands under the shoulders. We're going to come right up onto the toes. And we're going to hold this position here. Okay, this is conventional. Extended plank is here. I don't know if you can tell by the camera, but the second I went into an extended plank, my whole body was absolutely shaking because it's a lot tougher to hold. If you can do extended plank, great. If not, conventional plank. 
Everyone try that now quickly, 10 seconds. If you can get into extended, which is above your head, great, if not conventional. Just give it a quick test, see which version you're gonna do. So I've got nice straight lines. If you can get side onto the camera, great, so I can see. Okay, shake out, then shake out. We're gonna start the timer now, shake out. Okay, we're gonna do 30 seconds on, 10 seconds off, quick three hits, and then we'll go into the Emon, okay? First 30 seconds, we all good to go? Thumbs up, there's a few people adjusting, give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up, thumbs up, thumbs up. Yep, all on screen, okay, in three, two, one, into your plank, go. We're gonna hold for 30. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. Keep it nice and firm. Good, 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 good. Make sure we're locking them arms nice and tight. Elbows are straight and hard. Pulling that belly button into the spine, guys. Keeping the core nice and tight. Bracing the abs slightly. Hamstrings are tight. Glutes are tight. Can Stephanie get back in? I know your arms are tired. Your arms are really going to feel this as well. Really going to feel it. They've had a good workout. And down. 10 seconds. Down, down, down. Rest. Rest. In five, four, three, two. One, and again, go, 30 seconds, 30 seconds, back in. We're just gonna do a quick three rounds. Can, tan, get back in, come on. Hold it, that's 10 seconds gone, hold it. Good form everywhere, guys, we're looking good, we're looking good. Eight seconds left, keep it there, stay tight, focus. Three, Two, one, drop there, rest. Joe, if you can move your camera down a bit, hon, I can just about see the top of your head. <laughs> I'm sure you're doing it right, but I wouldn't know. <laughs> okay, we've got 10 seconds, we're going back in. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Let's go, hold it. Hold it, hold it, hold it. 30 seconds. Okay, that's 10 seconds gone. Good, keep it going guys, keep it going. Eight seconds, seven, six. Hold it, don't drop early. Get in Stephanie, five, four, three, two, one. Drop down there guys, drop down there. Okay, quickly grab a drink if you need to. I'm just going to show you the four exercises we've got for the EMOM. Indian squats, uh, single leg Romanian deadlifts, toe touch sit-ups and bicycle crunches. So just take a look in. I'm going to show you those movements. I will be showing them to you as you go along. So don't worry if you can't remember them all. Give your arms a shake out. I know they're going to be tired. We're not using them as much in this, so the arms are going to get a bit of a rest. So, Indian squats. If you've never done these before, just take them nice and slowly. You're going to do 15 in a minute. So... The main difference of an Indian squat, we're going to start with the arms behind us, okay? As we come down, I'm going to come up onto my toes. So I'm flat on my feet. As I come down, I come up onto my toes. My arms come through and they help me stand up. I go here, down onto my toes, up. Three. Four, okay? Everyone just practice that now quickly. So as I come down, my heels come off the floor. So my hands are behind me, my heels come off the floor, I'm on my toes, arms come through, stand up. Back behind me, down, stand up. Do three reps. Good, 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 good. Looking good, looking good. Okay, next exercise is gonna be a single leg Romanian deadlift. So the way we're gonna do these, if you can get side on your camera, great. The leg that's on the floor, okay? You wanna bend the knee. Hands are gonna go down, other leg goes out to the back. We're going to touch the floor, swap legs, bend knee, touch the floor, swap legs, bend knee, touch the floor. Okay, do six reps of that now, six repetitions. It's important to make a T position, so lean your chest down, put that leg out behind you. Good. Remember, the leg on the floor is a bent knee. It's a bent knee. Both hands are going to touch the floor as well, guys. Becky, both hands touch. Yeah, that's it, you got it. Both hands touch the floor, so we stay square and we don't open the hips. Good, we look like we've got those. Next one is toe touch sit-ups. Nice and simple. We lay down on the floor, 
Feet are going to go up in the air, okay? Slight bend in the knees, okay? We're going to come right up, touch the foot, touch the toes, touch the floor, touch the toes, okay? Everyone do three repetitions of that now. Three reps. Good, right up and touch the toes. And Laura, try not to get attacked by your dog while you're doing it. <laughs> I don't know if I saw it right, but then it looked like a dog jumped right in your head when you started. <laughs> okay, last exercise. We're going to do bicycle crunches. So after the 15, we're going to go bicycle crunches and wraps. So it's going to be opposite elbow to knee. Hands are going to be on the head. Feet are going to stay off the floor. I'm going to go right elbow to left knee, left elbow to right knee. There, 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 there. Now, okay, everyone do 10 reps nice and quickly. 10 reps. The whole time you're keeping your feet off the floor and trying to keep your shoulder blades off the floor and switching. You're going to do that for a whole minute. It's going to be beautiful. Okay, are we all happy? Well, as happy, can be, as happy as we can be now we're about to do an EMOM. <laughs> okay, grab a quick drink, 10 seconds. The first thing we're going to do is 15 Indian squats. Hold on one sec. Stay back. Can you do the first one again? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The first one, Indian squats, your hands are going to start behind you. As we come down, we come up onto the toes, we come round and up. Hands behind, down and up. Okay, just a quick reminder, we do 15 of those. Remember to come on your toes. Starting the timer, we're going to do 15 Indian squats first of all, starting in three, two, one, off we go, 15 reps. Yeah, if anyone missed anything, I will demo it as we go along, don't panic, I will demo it as we go along. So just 15 Indian squats. Remember to come right up on the toes, Louise, get them heels off the floor as you go down. It's all about balance because if you come on your toes and you do it too quickly, you're going to fall forwards. So it actually, uh, coming on the toes is going to slow you down and make you balance a little bit better. So it is important we get them heels off the floor as we come down. Good. Good, 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 good. Looking good, guys. When you've done your 15 reps, just chill out. You've got about 20 seconds. We're going into the single leg Romanian deadlifts. So we've got 10 seconds. Remember, single leg Romanian deadlifts. Bend, bend in the knee, it's on the floor, two hands, touch the floor, up, swap legs, up, swap legs, okay? Standing up nice and straight between each rep, down, up, down, up, don't rush it too fast, ready? Three, two, one, off we go, one leg at a time and then swap, both hands are going to go to the floor, make sure you control it, touch your hands down. It's not about doing them as fast as we can. we still got to have control, but we do as many as we can in that one minute. Good. Both hands to the floor. Guys, looking good. Looking good. Keep it going. Keep it going. You've still got 30 seconds. Keep it going. Make sure you stand up tall at the top, Louise. So do a rep, stand fully upright. That's it, then swap feet. Keep it moving, keep the legs moving. Keep going guys, 20 seconds. Keep it going. If anyone's got sore legs from yesterday, this is probably gonna feel not so great, but just keep it pushing. Two, one, 15 toe touch, sit ups, off you go. Down on your backs, 15 toe touch. Feet up in the air, get them shoulder blades right up off the floor, try and touch your toes, 15 reps. Good, when you're done your 15, catch your breath because we're going into bicycle crunches in 30 seconds. Remember, with the bicycle crunches, you want to keep the feet off the floor, pull the shoulder blades off the floor, and just keep the movement going, okay? Keep the movement going for the whole minute. This one's going to get really emotional real quick, but just do your best, try and stay with it. 
Okay, 10 seconds, get in position. On your back, ready to go. Feet off the floor in five, four, three, two, one. Off we go, one minute. Make sure we're trying to get them elbows right away to the knees, guys. Lifting them shoulder blades right up off the floor. Good. Good. That's it, Hayley. Really get them shoulder blades up. Really try and lean in and touch your knee to your elbow. Good. Nice, Becky. Looking good. Joe, I imagine you're doing it right, but the bottom of your trainers look fantastic. <laughs> keep going, guys. Keep going. Yes, yeah, a minute. Yes, yeah, a minute's worth, Claire. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Lift them shoulder blades up. Tan, come on. Get back in. Let's go. Good. Quick rest on me, foul, and then get back in. Rachel, I'm sure you're also doing it right, but I'm just looking at your chandelier at the minute. It looks lovely. Keep pushing, guys. Keep pushing. Three, two, one. Rest there. Rest there. Real bad burn. Okay. Back on your feet. Indian squats. 15 reps. Go. Good. So as we go down, we come up onto the toes. And as we stand up, we put the heels back down. So as you push down on the floor, we can push down off the heels. Just as we come down, we come on the toes. Good. 15 reps. Nice and controlled. Looking good. Good. Nice work, guys. Lindsay, good. Rachel, good. Keep it up. When we're doing those squats, Haley, keep your eyes looking forward, yeah? Try not to look too much at the floor. Try and keep your eyes up. As soon as you're done your 15 reps, just hang around. We're going straight into the single leg RDLs again. In three, two, one single leg RDL, so leg goes back, touch the floor, leg goes back, touch the floor, okay? Really keep it controlled in the hamstring. Back of the legs, keep it controlled. Let's go, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Nice, good control, Becky, love that, good control. Thirty seconds. Keep it up now. Keep it up. Keep it up. Keep going, guys. I know the legs are going to be feeling it a little bit. Last ten seconds. We're going straight into fifteen toe touch sit ups. In three, two, one. Down you go. Fifteen toe touch sit ups. When you've done your 15 shake out, remember we're going into bicycles for the whole minute in about 20 seconds. We're going in five, four, three, two, one. Bicycles, go. Really dig in now. Get them shoulder blades off the floor, guys. Really work. Get your shoulder blades off the floor. When we're talking about hands, we're going to put our hands on the side of our head, not behind our head. Okay, you're just pulling your neck forward. That's how we end up with trapped nerves and pulled muscles. Get your hands on your temple, fingers on the temple like this, and then do your rotations. So we're not pulling the head with the arms. Good. Keep it going, keep it going. Claire, try and keep both feet off the floor throughout, yeah? That's it, now do it. Uh, keep them off the floor. Keep your feet off the floor. They shouldn't touch the floor. Tan, get back in. Come on, Becky, back in, come on. We can do this. We can do this. Keep them feet off the floor, guys. I know they're sore. Just keep them moving. Come on, 15 seconds. Don't give up, Beck. Come on, back in. It's hilarious. Joe, I can just see your feet. It's great. I just got to imagine what you're doing. 
<laughs> oh, there's some hands as well. Three, two, one. Grab a drink. Grab a drink, quick five seconds. Quickly, because we're still on an EMOM. In five, four, three, two, one. Indian squats, off we go. 15 reps. It's the last round, guys. Last round, let's put it in. Good, good control, guys. 15 reps. Remember, you don't need to do these for speed. There's plenty of time to do 15 reps in a minute. So nice and controlled. Chest is up onto the toes. 20 seconds. Keep pushing. You've got eight seconds. If you've got any more to do, get them done. In two, one, and alternate in straight, uh, straight leg deadlifts. Go, single leg deadlifts. RDLs. Good. Both hands to the floor. Good. That's it, Stephanie. Keep it controlled. Keep it controlled. Don't just plummet your hands to the floor. You've got to control that movement. So gently touch your toes down. Puts the legs under stress. And we straighten that leg out that goes behind you as well. Straighten the leg out. The more you straighten the leg, the more you're challenging that leverage. Good, looking good guys, keep it going. Keep it going, we're just gonna keep going. Yeah, good work Carolina, keep it going. This is good, concentrate, concentrate, 15 seconds. Good control everywhere. Come on, keep it going Claire, come on, keep going. Two, one, 15 toe touches. In fact, 25 toe touch sit ups. Go, 25 reps. Go, it's the last round. Get up there 25 times. Get up and touch your toes. Get them shoulder blades off the floor. Don't bring your feet towards you. Yeah, keep your legs nice and long. Make it challenging. Get up there. Good. 25 reps, guys. 25 reps this round. Keep pushing, keep pushing. We're doing really well. Keep it going. Keep it going. When you've done your 25 reps, because we're going into the bicycles for the next minute. Nice work, Lindsay. Smash them out. Good stuff. Nice one, Dyer. Looking good. Okay, we've got 10 seconds. Three, two, one big finish then, bicycles for the finish. Keep them shoulder blades off the floor. I don't wanna see any feet going down this round. Come on, really dig in, really dig in. Make sure we touch, try and touch your elbow, physically touch your knee if you can. So get up, really rotate, use them abs. Use them abs, Tan, get back in, come on, feet off the floor, let's go. Concentrate, Can back in, come on. Joe, I can just see your feet, but they don't look like they're moving much. <laughs> Keep it going. There you go, keep it going. Okay, we're over 35 seconds, come on. We've got 20 seconds left now. 20 seconds, dig in. I know they're burning. Keep it going, last 10. Three, two, one. And rest it out there, guys. Rest it out there. Okay, I want to say epic session. Well done, everyone. Put the work in. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. I am going to unmute everyone, and I'm just going to stop the recording. Um, and then any, if anyone wants to ask me anything, by all means, hang around on the chat. If you've got to shoot off because you've got things to do, thanks for stopping by. Awesome session. I'm still in the WhatsApps if you need me. Um, I'm going to stop the screen recording now.